We baby nuts, aka Guerrero Senior, man. How you feeling today, man? Mad dog right here, man. <laughs> Where what brings you to Ontario this weekend? Oh man, I got two fighters here. I got Justin Cardona, my prospect. Mm -hmm. He's uh, 3-0 with three knockouts. And I got Escandon, mm -hmm. Oscar, mm -hmm. my two-time world champion. So, you know, we're going to give it another go, you know, and uh, ready to go, man. He's ready, sharp. So we're going to do this, man. How you been? I've been great, man. I've been great, you know. Just, you know, working with all my fighters, my young prospects, trying to move them up, you know. Mm -hmm. So I've been great. How's Robert doing? Robert's doing great, man. He's, he's coming down to the fight. He's going to be there. Supporting uh, Oscar Scandone, you know, so, and my other prospect, so we're ready to go. Uh, what you make of the welterweight division? Have, have you been keeping up with the welterweight division? Oh, yeah, yeah. Tell us what you think about it. It's pretty stacked, man. So Terrence Crawford's performance. What do you think of Terrence Crawford's performance oh, he's, last week? He's a, he's a, good, a good fighter. Mm -hmm. good, 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 good fight, man. So. Did you get a chance to hear uh, Timothy Bradley's comments? I didn't really get to, man. You didn't get to? Okay, yeah, good. Man. Okay, good. Yeah, so okay. Sweet. Who would you say... How would you rank the welterweight division right now in terms of one, two, three? I think uh, I think it's like one right now. Welterweight. No, who? Who? Like, like Earl Spence, oh, oh. Terrence Crawford. Who's the best welterweight, would you say? Well, right now, I think Earl Spence is the, the, the best welterweight right mm -hmm. now. Out there. You know, mm -hmm. he's, he's really doing it, man. But, you know, once he gets his uh, life back together, you know, take care of those little injuries he had, mm -hmm. he'll be back on, back on the saddle. He'll be, he'll be one, of the, one of the best. You know? Now, Robert, now your son is probably in contention for a title eliminator. That's the best welterweight right there. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Title eliminator. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, uh, who would you want? What belt would you want? The WBC, IBF, WBO, WBA? Uh, uh, which route are y'all on course for? Any, anyone that shoot at us, man, we're ready. So, you know, we're, we, don't, uh, we don't pick them. We don't choose them. So we're ready to go whoever, whoever's there. You know, when, when, do you when do you anticipate getting back in? in the ring? Uh, probably around March, somewhere around there, you know. And he's good, he's locked and loaded, oh, fully healed. He's fully healed, he's ready, he's rested, got everything cleared out of his mind, he's hungry again, he's back like the way he used to be, you know. Beautiful, once beautiful. You get all this big money, once you three, four, five, six, four time champion, you're not hungry no more, you know, so you gotta find out what it is to be hungry. Mm -hmm. So you know what, he found out, he's back again. So you know, it's not because of the money, it's nothing, he just wants to his legacy, he wants to do it one more time. Mm. He's going to shoot for a world title again, Robert. He wants to be world champion again. Could he do? Could he go down to 140 since you're training? Do you think he can go down to 140? Uh, 140 is no, just it. No, we don't go backwards. Bro. We, we're staying right there at 147. 140. That's where it's at. That's, Th where that's where the money's at. Yeah, that's, that's it. And that's where he belongs. So, you mm -hmm. know. He can go down to 140. He can. That, that's why I was asking. Yeah, that's why I was asking. Yeah. 147 is where it's at. 147 is where the money's at, right? Uh, but he came out at, he came from one. The names, are, the names, the names. Okay. He came up from 122, so. You know, I, I remember. You know, I remember. So, yeah. You know, he's a small guy, Robert. So uh -huh. now he's he's comfortable in that weight, you know. Mm -hmm. So that's where we're gonna stay. He'll make that weight easy mm -hmm. and strong, you know. Deontay Wilder, Tyson Fury is coming up. How you like that one? Oh, man, Deontay Wilder. Deontay Wilder. He's a big boy. He's a big hitter. Uh -huh. And this time, I think he's he's gonna take it more serious this uh -huh. time. You know what I mean? Uh huh. So it'll be a good fight, though. You okay. know, don't get me wrong. Uh -huh. You know, Tyson Fury is a good fighter, you know, mm -hmm. but hey, Bianca Wilder, like he says, man, he, he's a, a hammer. Uh -huh. He can hammer hard, man. And you spent some time at 135. Uh, talk about uh, TFM. Did you get a chance to see TFM Lopez last weekend? Uh, no, no, I didn't get to see him. How about Tank Davis? Have you seen Tank Davis fight? No. <laughs> How about Lomachenko? No? no? I only watch Robert Durant. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, Robert, yeah, that's, that's a great I answer. Watch, I watch Machenko. Okay. Bit, you know, some fights, you know. But. How good is he, do you think? Uh, he's, he's an average good fighter, you know, but we'll see. Now that he's moving up, you know. Mm -hmm. So, you know, that once you move up, man, you're going to see a different different level right there, man. Mm -hmm. You know, bigger and stronger guys, you know. And, and you're not to say, you don't have the same speed mm -hmm. as you used to have before, man, mm -hmm. you know. Once you... Get up and wait. It's a whole different ball game. Mm -hmm. Bigger and harder hitters right there, you know. So. Who did y'all start with promotion-wise? Was it just Golden Boy? Who did y'all start with? We fought with uh, Golden Boy, and then. Uh, Prior to that, who were you with? With, with Goose and Tweeter. Okay. Yeah. So your first big-time promoter was Golden Boy, and then to PBC. No, Is that? No, no, no. We had Goose and Tweeter, then uh, then Golden Boy, and then PBC. Okay. I, I was just wondering. I was just wondering if you ever dealt with. Yeah. Top rank, and can we get these fights? Because everyone is wondering, like, will Terrence Crawford fight yeah. some of the PBC yeah. fight? I thought maybe you well, had no experience in that. Yeah, yeah. So, but, uh, you know, we're ready to go. I'm here. 
Yeah, er early spring, ready. Robert Guerrero steps back in the ring. That's it, man. We're ready. Robert's going to be ready. He's looking sharp right now. He's working. Mm -hmm. you know? Oh, yeah. Andy Ruiz. What do you think of Andy Ruiz's performance? Oh, man. I don't know what happened there, to tell you the truth. But, hey, the, uh, what's his name was smart. He used the jab. Mm -hmm. He used his jab. Uh -huh. And uh, he did a good job. Mm -hmm. And that's how you win fights, you know, using your jab, you know. Uh -huh. so, he didn't take him lightly this time. I think the last time he took him lightly. Sure. So, you know, he did a good job. How did you feel about him saying, I, I partied too much and I came in overweight? Hey, well, I don't know, man. There shouldn't be no excuse there. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I think he was using that excuse, you know what I mean? But I think he, was, he, should, he should have been ready. Maybe he did party a little bit, but you know what, man? That's on your own self. You know what sure. I mean? Mexicans like tacos, man. Yeah. <laughs> now, tacos over 30 million? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like my dad said, you know, money gets the fighters. Uh -huh. That's what got to him. That's it, yeah. Got I got it. So, I okay, respect the guy's father. You know, he, he didn't humble himself. He should have humbled himself. Mm -hmm. you're, you're in a, you put yourself in a big spot now. Got gotcha. you. Bigger paydays. Got gotcha. you. Know, she had a Dante Wilder fight. You know what I mean? Woo! Oh, so, hey. He would have gave Dante Wilder a little trouble on the inside, but Dante would have knocked him out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you got to stay ready all the time, man. Uh -huh. you know? hey, once, you, once you win that title, world title, you got to stay hungry. You got to yeah. stay there. You got to be ready for who's coming to you. Because all these guys are coming. They're coming for you. you know? So you got to be ready. You got to stay on your game. You know? And uh, that's what happened. And that came about is his first, first, first title defense. And this is what happened. He lost it right away. So mm -hmm. what does that tell you? You know? You gotta stay on top of things, man. You know, so maybe he needs a coach like me. Okay, you baby. <laughs> I'll be on his ass, man. I'll tell you one thing. He ain't gonna lose that title, brother. Hey, Come on. But he drives Rafe's, not Impalas, though. Oh, he don't drive Impalas. He drives Rafe's and Ghosts oh, and Rolls Royce. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> My brother Robert, man, he's got ten. I mean, no. Got ten cars, class cars. They're all in Paulus. Uh -huh, I know. That's what I said. I know that. Days. I know the family, man. That's yeah, why I said it. Uh, that's, what I know. that's what I know. That's what I know. That's, that's what I know. I know. I remember. I remember. I remember. Yeah. I remember. Yeah. I remember. Yeah. I remember. Hey, they look like cockroaches, eh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 I call them. I call them cockroaches, man. But they look like cockroaches all over. Yeah. 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 Oh man. For any last words? Any last words? Because y'all about to head out. Any last yeah, words? I just want to say hi to everybody. Merry Christmas, everybody. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Say hi, Merry Christmas to everybody. Mm -hmm. Matt Dog loves you all, guys. Uh -huh. Everybody out here. Uh -huh. Good luck. Uh -huh. Thank you, Mr. Thank you, Mr. Guerrero. Appreciate you.